for marking your catalog in the International Brown Swiss Show, there were 43 heifers in the fall heifer calf class. 1764 was 17th and 6th junior. 1765 was 19th. 1766 did not show. 1767 was 29th and 13th junior. 1768 did not show. 1769 was fourth in the class and your first place junior. She is Hilltop Acres CT Glaze, owned by Caleb, Cole, and Carter Cruzy of Dyersville, Iowa. 1770 was fifth in the class and your second place junior. She is Eminem Thunderstruck, leased by Jackson Bowie and owned by Eminem Swiss, the Stussel family of Alma Center, Wisconsin. 1771 was 20th and 7th junior. 1772 did not show. 1773 was 40th. 1774 was 35th in the class and the 15th junior. 1775 was 18th. 1776 was 25th and 12th junior. 1777 did not show. 1778 was 38th in the class. 1779 was 8th. 1780 was 24th in the class and 11th junior. 1781 was 12th and 4th junior. 1782 was 21st and 8th junior. 1783 did not show. 1784 was 36th. 1785 was first in the class. She is Brooke Hollow Totally Had It ET, owned by Leslie and Linda Bruschi of Westminster, Maryland. 1786 was 27th. 1787 was 11th in the class. 1788 did not show. 1789 was 16th. 1790 was 14th. 1791 and 1792 did not show. 1793 was sixth in the class. 1794 did not show. 1795 was seventh. 1796 was 41st in the class and the 16th junior. 1797 was 15th. 1798 was 37th. 1799 did not show. 1800 was 23rd in the class and 10th junior. 1801 was 31st in the class. 1802 did not show. 1803 was 34th. 1804 was 22nd and 9th junior. 1805 was 9th in the class and the third place junior. 1806 was second in the class and the bread and owned winner. She is All Glow Carter Popsicle, owned by Justin and Ashley Kaufman of Berlin, Pennsylvania. 1807 did not show. 1808 was third in the class. She is Fairdale Renegade B. Cali E.T., owned by Fairdale Farm LLC of Owenton, Kentucky. 1809 was 33rd in the class and your 14th, excuse me, junior. 1810 was 42nd and the 17th junior. 1811 was 32nd. 1812 was 28th in the class. 1813 was 10th. 1814 was 30th. 1815 was 26th. 1816 was 43rd. 1817 was 39th in the class. 1818 and 1819 did not show. 3004 was 13th in the class and 5th junior. Now in the ring are the Brown Swiss Summer Yearlings. First place award is presented by Colos Brown Swiss, Sarah Harn of Brooklyn, Wisconsin. The bred and owned award is presented by Elite Dairy, Peter Vale and Ken Main of Copake, New York. Junior Award is presented by Maple Sugar Farm, the Young Family of Brandon, Vermont. The Junior Ribbons and Medallions for the show are sponsored by Accelerated Genetics, and the Neck Medallions and Ribbons for the Open Show are sponsored by Ytex Corporation. Thank you to all of our sponsors.
placings are now complete in this summer yearling class. Let's meet our winners. The second place junior is entry 1844, Onward V. Vernita Twin, exhibited by Carter Cruzy, the animal owned by Dennis Warden of Olwine, Iowa. That's right, show your appreciation, congratulations. The winning junior entry is entry 1834, Cutting Edge S. Dagmar, exhibited by Dakota J. Fraley of Muncie, Pennsylvania. Third place in the class goes to entry 1849, DSKM Carter Juniper, exhibited by Brothers Three Brown Swiss of North Prairie, Wisconsin. Second place honors to entry 1850, Brown Heaven Carter Tootie, exhibited by Matthew Pacheco of Canton to Hatley, Quebec. And your winning entry in the best bread and known to the class is entry 1846, Brook Hollow B Posh Party, exhibited by Delbert and Heather Yoder and Interstate Heifer Care of West Salem, Ohio. Congratulations. Steve, your reasons on this class. Another tremendous, tremendous class of heifers here right down the line. And for me today, me and Chip, we came to the conclusion it was an easy winner for us. A heifer so hard on top. She's so balanced. She has such ring patterns since she has that long angular frame that we love to see. A heifer moves around this ring with such ease on those feet and legs. And that's what gives her our nod today over our second heifer. A big, strong heifer coming in second. It's Heifer, you admire that overall openness and depth. The heifer, maybe we like to change that rump structure just a tad. But another well-deserving heifer to come in to second. Second over third, just holds herself a touch nicer there through the front end when she gets in the line, a little bit better on her legs when she's out on the move than our third, than our third place heifer. Third over fourth, just on that mass. Our fourth place heifer, a really long, dairy open heifer. A heifer, we just like to see her mass up like the three above her. And we follow them with fourth, another real massive heifer. A heifer, we just like to clean her up through that head and neck, lengthen her out from end to end to compete with the heifers above her. Then we have an August heifer and a late July heifer kind of coming in here. Real stylish heifers as you see them from the side. Heifers that have that balance, that high style profile. Just don't quite have the mass to come with these June heifers that are above them. Congratulations, Brownswiss exhibitors, on another great class.